morning guys welcome to Sunday today is Sunday I actually can't believe that we still do daily vlogs like are you guys still feeling the daily daily vlogs or do you think we should just make videos and share parts of our story specific parts of our story feeling the daily vlogs but anyway today is Sunday and we're gonna start this day out with a bang we got Sophie we got Gabby we got Sam and Ruby and we have Hi. Molly and we have Macy Toby's Hi. in his crate hello, hello. don't be sucking up so uh, one of the things that you guys probably don't get to see very often is that Sam and Gabby and I all fight over Molly we all I love her Gabby, Sophie loves her too, but we all love her and we all think she loves us best. Like, she will follow me around if Gabby doesn't have her on a leash, like so tight to herself. Why do you think Molly loves you best? Because I take her outside all the time. Why do you think she loves you the most? I know she doesn't because you guys give her food. Because I'm at Gabby. They give her food. Are you coming around like, they to give me? Her human food. Are you coming around? I think she loves me best because oh, I give her human food. Why do you think she loves you best? Because I'm nice. Yeah. I actually do. Nice girls her. never win. No, just joking. Nice actually, girls always her. win. But anyways, we are going to find out now. We are going to actually find out and figure it out. Oh. Every time we've done a test in the past, it, it seems to be like whoever screams the loudest that Molly runs to. So today, I'm changing the rules. Today, we're going to do this on a larger scale. We're going to let her run to us. We're going to call her while somebody is holding on to her. And as soon as they let go, we're going to stop calling her and see who she chooses. She's the baby girl. Do you think she's going to choose you? Yes. Do you think she's going to choose you? She's the baby girl. Do you think she's going to choose you? No. I'm not going to lie. I really think she's going to choose me. I think this is the time that somebody is going to choose me. To be honest, I feel like Molly really does love me because I am loving to her. Like Sophie said. I feel like I'm the most loving to her and that's what she appreciates. And we're gonna find out. All right, so I am gonna have Sophie stand here and I'm gonna have her hold Molly. Us three are gonna stand down there in a row and we're gonna call her. And once we're done calling her, once we're done calling her, you let her go and you have to hold the camera, okay? I can't hold the camera. You're gonna have to. Molly, I got the treats. I never did that, I was just kissing her. Why don't we go over there then? Let me kiss her then. Molly. All right. All right. Let's go over there then. Change of plans. Sophie's going to stand here and we're going to go down there. Unfortunately, Sophie doesn't think that she can handle the dog and the camera. So we're all choosing our spots. I'm going to stand here. Gabby might as well stand in the middle. And then we're going to all call her. Wait, can we, can we sit? Yeah, you can sit. She'll... All right. Hold on. Just wait. Just wait. Just wait. Molly, come on. Wait, don't let her go yet. Just wait. Come on, Molly. Come on, Molly. Okay, go. Molly, Molly. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done. What do we do to love? Again and change spots. All right, so she chose Gabby, so now Gabby's gonna be out, and she's gonna be between the three of us. Everybody move to the right. We have switched spots. We're gonna start in a second. We're gonna start calling her. Okay, come on, Molly. Come on, come on, Molly. Come on. Three, two, one, stop. Go. What do we do to love? What do we oh, that's beautiful. Come on, Molly. Come on. Oh. You're whistling. Stop whistling. That's not fair. <laughs> I'm never going to question it again. Even though Gabby leaves all the time, we take care of her. She loves her girl. 
So Gavin says she loved that she psyched me, but the problem was not, it was fixed again. You whistled, you whistled. You That's, talked. Whoever says anything. As soon as I stopped talking though, they were whistling. They were like, play them, play this thing back. You guys. You called her. You called That's her. why when I said, let her go. That's because she wasn't going to come. Stop because he was whistling. Was I know. Like, so she even went to Gabby when you were whistling. She'll come to anybody who whistles. <laughs> I said something like, I was like, go get her. And she was like, wait, what? <laughs> yes, go get her, go get her, go get her. One thing is for sure, our puppy is so super loved and she knows it. She's so super active, not any more active than Ruby. She didn't even go to you. Yeah, I know. She was going to you, but then I said. Right, we should have done this like a week ago when Gabby was away at Kaylee's and she really loved me then. She followed me everywhere. Even when Gabby came home, she was following me everywhere. This only goes to show one thing. I need my own puppy. Wait, I already have my own puppy. He just doesn't run. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? What do we do to love? When everything's said and done. What do we do to love? What do we do to love? It's actually supposed to be our coolest day for the next week at least. It's supposed to be nice and cool, 24 degrees, 24 degrees. We're gonna, probably gonna get lessons, hopefully. The fly situation has gotten a lot better the last couple of days. I don't know why it was bad for a while. So bad over here. Yeah, not awesome. But Sam's gonna hook up one of our fly nets. So this yeah, thermometer says it's 100 that. degrees. I feel like it's a bit fixed because it's just sitting here in the sun. It does not feel like 100 degrees. It does. But 100 degrees is a lot better than 108 like it has been. Look at that girl, loving her girl. Gabby talks, Molly runs. Yeah. Throw a rock, let's show them how they get, how she chases rocks. I kind of want to go to the beach today, but I kind of want to stay home and play with our horses when and our dogs. Up, can you change with me and we yeah. can go swimming? So what she does is if she finds, loses the rock, she just finds another. Good girl. Drop it. Good girl. Did you find a different she, one? She drops things. Like, it took all of our other dogs so long to learn drop it, and she drops it, like, so uh, fast. What do we do to love when everything's said and done? What do we do to love? on all this I don't know if you guys can see but there are lots of spots that I've got oh, free yeah. so here's the, the view from over here as well I got a lot of it done it just doesn't look like a lot because there's still a lot left I also did a bunch over here and then this morning I started over here the problem is the lawnmower gets clogged up really fast and I have to stop and unclogged. All right, so we are headed out. They're headed out to nowhere, to nowhere, because there's no place to go, you guys, unless we go to the beach or shopping, which there's not very many places that we can shop, and the shopping experience has just gotten a whole lot worse than it ever was. So we're just gonna go for a little drive and get coffee. It's the only thing we can do that's fun. Only thing. We have horses. Yeah, we have horses. We are gonna come back, and we are gonna play with our horses, but. We have Maisie. The only one we forgot is Toby. I should have brought him. I'm sad I didn't bring him. I like to go in the car because they can watch DVDs in here. So today's movie of the day is called The Greatest Showman, one of the greatest movies of all time. All right, so our Tim Hortons has put up a nice shade thing for people who are standing in line. There's a walk-up thing that you can get coffee. So in Canada, we still are not all the way open. I know some places are completely open. It just floors me. Like. We can't even eat in a restaurant yet. Look at these people, they're doing a TikTok. She's like, oh my God. But yeah, she was so super embarrassed. Yeah, that's what you do when you're standing in, when you're parked in the Tim Hortons. We should do one. Yeah, let's do it. You wanna do it? No. Now you guys do it. Come on, can you do that? Can't walk on my hands either. We should have honked our horns and been supportive. They saw us videoing them though. Look where we are. We're at the quarry and these kids are gonna jump. Hurry up, I wanna get up there. I feel like they're scared. Okay, so we brought Molly just for a quick swim on our way home from the donut store. See if she'll just 
go in willingly. Good girl. She's like, ooh, it's wet, mama. Good girl. Yeah, I get it, because your owner's got all her clothes on. Oh my gosh. He just did it. Goodness. I keep missing it. You no, know, me too. They're literally like so tiny. So tiny and they just jump. They just jump straight down. Such a good puppy. It's our swimming girl. That was our dream for the summer. That was my dream for the summer that she'd get so in love with the water. What a good puppy. She's grown. I know. She's grown so much. She's, she's like. Not done yet. I know. I know. Good girl. Good girl. Oh, you got water in your ear. I think that's enough. Not too far. You're gonna run and get it. Go get it! Go get it! Go get it! You can tell when she doesn't touch. You can tell when she doesn't Oh, she's asking. Look, she wants it. Like, she, she's not done. Make her come back out and run in, because that was good. Wow, that was far. That's because she's cheating. No, good girl. Tell her she's done. like just our puppy is only four months old and what I wanted more than anything like I believe that you have to teach them young young what you or want them to do later or else like it's harder when you're older to new to, to you can't teach an old dog new tricks right yeah, anyways you can, cause yeah babies. you can but I literally never thought she would love water like she does like I don't know if you guys could see we were like Watching for signs that she was done. She tells us when she's tired. She tells us when she's done yeah, every she time. Runs away she runs like when in. we were throwing the rock earlier when she was done. 
she'd pick it up and she'd run past us and lay down with it. So we know when she's done. And she was like on fire. She was like ready, steady, ready, set. Like she just wanted to do it again and again. Finally, we had to call it quits because it was, it's a lot. Swimming is a lot for a little dog like her. Her hind end though is all muscle. Like she's pure muscle. Good muscle girl. Muscle playing with Ruby and yeah. We didn't have two leashes in the car, otherwise we would have taken Ruby too. And I'm glad we kind of didn't because there was another dog there. We are out shopping and he just reminded me. I keep forgetting that we have to wear masks. So we are on the hunt for better masks. Sam's actually bought, ordered us some masks and they're gonna come this week. And we have friends that have been making them. I don't know, it just seems awkward though. So let's mask up. I'm no stranger to a mask, you guys. I used to have to wear masks. In my old job for like 22 years. He would love a, a unicorn one or a mermaid one. Oh. Or like a diamond one. And Gabby would like a Spider-Man one. Oh my God, Gabby would totally like Spider-Man. Those are the three that we want right there. All right, so I don't know for sure that Gabby's gonna like Spider-Man, but I don't know, I just feel like it's kind of her. Let's try it on, I got diamonds. Diamonds, you guys, totally me. All right, I'm not gonna lie, this material 150% better than my other one, I love it. Let me see yours. Okay, that's funny. Look how funny this is. Look, I look like the Joker. That's cute. Sam, Sam's are really small. I like mine. It's not as hot as that other one. I love it. Thank you. I love it. All right, Lazy Bones. We got you new masks. Are you excited? We got, wait. We got, we got you a mermaid or a unicorn. We got you a superhero. You went to the dollar store Let's see you spin your web, Gabby. See, I knew it. She's. Yeah, on purpose because all you want to do is buy junk. It's not my favorite one though. Oh, they didn't have anything good. You wouldn't want diamonds. Like diamonds are boring. You know, the plain black one like I bought. Yes, I want the plain black ones. What about diamonds? And it changes the sequence. Yeah, it's so cute. Try it on. Plain black one. I'll have both. I got five of those. Put, let's put them in our cars. My dog just that chills part. on the couch now. Part? Yeah. My dog chills on the couch now. Get off the couch. Thank She's gosh, wet. Uh -huh. Oh, you look good in Spider-Man, to be honest. And they're not as hot. They're so loose. We can adjust it. Oh, you look good. I love it. Let's see, do this. Oh, yours is such a different material. Mine's like so slinky, silky. Can I try yours? Mm-hmm. Diamonds. It's not diamonds. Oh, love it. Love it, Spider-Man. They're actually more breathable. Mm -hmm, they're more breathable. <laughs> Yours is small. Like, wait. One thing you guys might not notice is that he chases the dogs. He goes over and finds them, and our dogs are petrified of the horses. And which I think, it's a, I think it's a healthy thing. I think it's healthy for them to be a bit scared. But he does love some little animals. He loves babies. You're getting a baby kitten soon, Stormy, and he's gonna grow up around you. His name is Ollie. And Sophie's is he thought of that name. Your best friend. Yeah, you gotta be nice to Ollie. You gotta be nice. Yeah, he he loves his kitties. He loves his small pet, and he loves his little kids. Storm loves any of these. See, like imagine sitting there and then having this animal, huge animal, with its face in your business all up in his biz all up in your business oh you guys probably have noticed that we're in our bathing suits a lot in the vlogs lately it's summer it's a heat wave there's not much you can do to get away from that and some of you guys have sent us messages saying like you guys got to be watching out for the <laughs> to, for the creepy guys out there and we do know about that I had a friend once that had this really huge channel a happening channel her kids did um, gymnastics and pedophiles like gymnastic kids. They don't seem to like horseback riding kids. She went through this whole time where she was trying to fight it. It was like a whole pedophile ring. Uh, yeah, they are kind of racist. Got me saying pedophiles are racist because they don't like equestrian girls. Well, that's fine with me. <laughs> uh, anyways, so when I went through this with my friend, she had this 
our channels were growing at the same speed and hers grew so fast and she got hundreds and thousands and hundreds and thousands hundreds of thousands of views on videos and anyway so while she's going through this she was learning like how to protect her kids from pedophiles and, and not get caught up in the pedophile ring and so we do a lot of the things that YouTube recommends that we do like we try not to put well we don't put our kids in bathing suits in thumbnails and that keeps them from like even coming to our channel and we stay away from certain words we like there's been a lot of things over the years that we haven't done to keep them away and it's worked you guys have some of you guys have seen on our channel recently there's some um bot comments directing people to like adult channels those are not that's different from the pedophile ring and pedophiles that's like a bot like they're just mass spamming us to get views to their site like they don't know anything about us they don't watch our videos nothing like that um but the whole pedophile thing um there's always going to be some kind of creepy people watching your videos no matter what things you do to protect yourself and your children and you can only do your best but for the most part we've been able to keep away from the whole pedophile ring there's like seriously a huge ring and it's really bad and if you get caught up in that which is a lot of family channels do because they show like a lot of kids stuff and they do like bath time routines and and stuff like that and um a lot of them have lost comments and so the one of the reasons that we're allowed to have comments is because we've never got caught up in that ring because like i said perverts do not like equestrian people they don't like horses so another win for the equestrian world don't you know that you're beautiful